Steve Gladstone. I'm half Jewish, half Catholic. I don't know what to do with all the guilt. I'm a photographer. Oh, that's good. Hold it right there. I shot a lot of celebrities. Bob Marley, Bob Dylan, Paul Bowles, Harry Dean Stanton, Muddy Waters, Dizzy Gillespie. Been in the studio, published a lot of work in magazines. I've shot photographs all over the world. Morocco, Guatemala, Australia, Bali, Thailand. So here we are in Phuket, Thailand. We're gonna come a little bit closer to the trunk here. Got lost in Saigon. Got lost. Almost got murdered in Cuba. I wanna find beauty in the ugly. Here I am with one of the most beautiful women I've ever seen in my life. Interesting, in the mundane. <laughs> we might even get lost. That's the most important thing of all. As we're going through these places. Hi. Hi. Where are we going to go today? I'm on the road. I've come here to get lost. I'm on an adventure. I'm here to share the stories of love, life, and survival. All in the cliff of a shutter. It's very important to practice some kind of decency in this world and to give a little bit of a helping hand. For instance, this little doggy right over here, the cutest little thing you ever seen. Is that the cutest? <laughs> He's not really a Buddhist. No, a car almost runs me over. I'm so absorbed in getting the shot. Hold it, hold it, man. Gotcha. High contrast. We're looking at these eyes, and he's telling us his story. Whoa. Whoa. Gonna bite that? He's going to spill that ice cream cone a little bit, but he's going to be okay with it, you know? I meet this Russian kid. What's your name, man? Hey, good to meet you. You look great, man. Let me get a shot of you right there. I guess he was homeless, but he looked okay. I have my bag in my hand, nothing else in documents. He had a heart, man. Really bad things happen, uh, so happy things happen, just it's life. Now I'm just looking at him, I'm just going, drop down, because I can see the light now. And I was picking up this perfect light. There he is. He's giving me what I call the look looking right into me, fearlessly. Great. Beautiful, man. Whoa! When I'm on the street, I'm fearless. I'll walk up to anybody, talk to anybody. Basically, my heart is true. I'm just trying to get a good shot, but it's dangerous out there. You're holding a $10,000 camera. I don't think most people can do what I do. It's like gonzo photography. You gotta be tough. You gotta be aware. You gotta know the streets. Killed. I'm just looking at uh, the composition here, his face, even this hair right here, the way the hair is going here. Remembering that there's no makeup and stylists involved. This is just a spontaneous moment on the streets. Way to go. I'm in Santa Cruz, California. I got a studio there. I hear this sound coming from the Kuwamba Jazz Center. I go, oh my God, Dizzy Gillespie's playing. I go backstage. I ask the guy, can I take a shot of you? And I'm thinking to myself, no way, he'll never let me do it. Next thing I know, he shows up at my studio with his whole band. I got my lights set up. I got my cameras, my strobes. I look at this guy and I go, brother. And they all started laughing. I mean, What's this white kid doing? And Dizzy just fucking laughed. I tilted down my tripod, had the Hasselblad there. Bam! Got him, snap. I saw this guy in a movie called The Sheltering Sky. In the movie, Paul Bowles says, Are you lost? And that resonated with me. I was in Spain. I took a ferry to Morocco. And within that same afternoon, I managed to find where he lived. Knocked on his door and he let me in. He's sitting on his bed and he's old and he's frail. And I take the shot of him. I said to him, where should I go in Morocco? And he said, go to Shashawan. 
So the next thing I know, I'm in Chef Shower, Morocco. I get up into the mountains. There's a mansion on this hill. And it's like a hashish factory. I'm walking outside, and this girl appears. The wind is blowing. The sun is coming down. And she's just so witchy and amazing. And I went, what's your name? And she went, Hannah. And I went, Hannah, look at me. And I went, click. I'm a little bit intense. I'm a little bit crazy. But they see my heart. My aim is true. And they embrace me. I'm just trying to capture um, a 60th of a second of life and bring it onto your TV and show you what it's like to be a shooter. And every time I go on the road, something crazy happens. And um, we just don't know where we're going. And that's the whole point of this show. You want to walk through the streets with me? Then let's go.